Buddhist temples in Thailand are known as wats, from the Pali vada, meaning an enclosure. A temple has an enclosing wall that divides it from the secular world. Topic: <laughs> Wat architecture. Wat architecture has seen many changes in Thailand in the course of history. Although there are many differences in layout and style, they all adhere to the same principles. A Thai temple, with few exceptions, consists of two parts, the Futhawad and the Sankhawad. Futhawad The Futhawad Thai, is the area which is dedicated to Buddha. It generally contains several buildings. Chedi Thai, Sidi also known as a stupa it is mostly seen in the form of a bell-shaped tower, often accessible and covered with gold leaf, containing a relic chamber. Prang Thai, Prang the Thai version of Khmer temple towers, mostly seen in temples from the Sukhothai and the Ayutthaya period. Ubozo or Bot Thai, Zubas or Thai, Bas the ordination hall and most sacred area of Awat. Eight Sima stones Bai Sima, Thai, Bai Sima mark the consecrated area. Wihan Thai, Wihar in Thai temples this designates a shrine hall that contains the principal Buddha images. It is the assembly hall where monks and laypeople congregate. Mandap Thai, Manth Pa Mandap is a specific square or cruciform based building or shrine, sometimes with a spurred roof within a Thai Buddhist temple or temple complex. It is a ceremonial structural form that can be applied to several different kinds of buildings. It can house relics, sacred scriptures, or act as a shrine. Unlike the Mandapa of Khmer or Indian temple, which are part of a larger structure, the Thai Mandap is a freestanding unit. Ho Tri Thai, Hikstur the temple library or scriptures depository houses the sacred Tipitaka scriptures. Sometimes they are built in the form of a mandap Thai, Framanth P a cubical shaped building where the pyramidal roof is carried by columns. Sala Thai, Sala an open pavilion providing shade and a place to rest. Sala Khan Parian Thai, Sala Karpuri a large, open hall where laity can hear sermons or receive religious education. It literally means hall, in which monks study for their Parian exam", and is used for saying afternoon prayers. Ho Rakang Thai, Hex Rakang the bell tower is used for waking the monks and to announce the morning and evening ceremonies. Phra Rabang Thai, Frey Rabaying a peristyle is sometimes built around the sacred inner area as a cloister. Additional buildings can also be found inside the Futawat area, depending on local needs, such as a crematorium or a school. The buildings are often adorned with elements such as chofas. In temples of the Ratanakasan era, such as Wat Pha and Wat Ratchabofit, the Ubozo can be contained within a low inner wall called a Kamfang Kyo, Thai, Kafang Kyo which translates to crystal wall. Sankawit <laughs> The Sankawit Thai, Sankawas contains the living quarters of the monks. It also lies within the wall surrounding the whole temple compound. The Sankawit area can have the following buildings Kuti Thai, Kuti originally a small structure, built on stilts, designed to house a monk, with its proper size defined in the Sankathaset, Rule 6, to be 12 by 7 cup 4 by 2 meters. Modern kudas take on the shape of an apartment building with small rooms for the monks. The Sankawit can also contain the Ho Rakang bell tower and even the Sala Khan Parian sermon hall. It will house most of the functional buildings such as a kitchen building where food can be prepared by laity, and sanitary buildings. <laughs> Temple elements Roof <laughs> forms. <laughs> Multiple roof tiers are important element of the Thai temple. The use of ornamented multiple tiers is reserved for roofs on temples, palaces and important public buildings. Two or three tiers are most often used, but some royal temples have four. The use of multiple roof tiers is more aesthetic than functional. Because temple halls are large, their roof areas are massive, to lighten up the roof's appearance, the lowest tier is the largest, with a smaller middle layer and the smallest roof on top. Multiple breaks in each roof lighten it further, a double-tiered roof might have two to four breaks in each tier. Dynamic visual rhythms are created by these multiple tiers, breaks and tier patterns. 
In northern temples, the roof area is larger, sweeping low towards the ground to cover more of the wall. The lower tiers telescope farther to the entrance. In Central Thai Temple, the lower tiers telescope just a short distance beyond the top roof at the gable ends. Topic roof finials Most decorations are attached to the bargeboard, the long, thin panel on the edge of the roof at the gable ends. The decorative structure is called the lamyong. The lamyong is sculpted in an undulating, serpentine nag sedung shape evoking the naga. Its blade like projection called bai raka suggests both naga fins and the feathers of Garuda. Its lower finial is called a hang hong, which usually takes the form of a naga's head turned up and facing away from the roof. The naga head may be styled in flame like kranic motifs and may have multiple heads. A roof with multiple breaks or tiers has identical hang hong finials at the bottom of each section. Perched on the peak of the lamyong is the large curving ornament called a chaffa, which resembles the beak of a bird, perhaps representing Garuda. Topic popular temple icons Thai Theravada Buddhism and Hindu cultures merged, and Hindu elements were introduced into Thai iconography. Popular figures include the four-armed figure of Vishnu, the Garuda half man, half bird, the eight-armed Shiva, elephant-headed Ganesh, the Naga, which appears as a snake, dragon or cobra, and the ghost-banishing giant Yaksha. Topic see also topic Depictions of the Buddha Development of the Buddha image in Thailand Iconography of Gautama Buddha in Laos and Thailand Characteristics of a Thai Buddha topic Statues and ornamentation, deities, demons and mythical beings Aspara Arawan Ganesh Garuda Hanuman Indra Kanara Kurtamukha Makara Naga Rama Ravana Shiva Vishnu Yaksha topic Architectural elements Chofa topic General Thai art Buddhist temples in Thailand Buddhism in Thailand Ramakian Sumaru Hamavanta topic References Discovery Channel by Scott Rutherford, Insight Guides, Thailand, APA Publications GmbH & Co., 2004. Discovery Channel by Steve Van Beek, Insight Pocket Guide, Thailand, APA Publications GmbH & Co., 2004. Maria Grazia Casella and Paula Piaco, Thailand, Nature and Wonders, Asia Books Co., Ltd., 2004. John Hoskin and Gerald Cubitt, This is Thailand. Asia Books Co., Ltd., 2003 Further reading Carl Doring, Buddhist Temples of Thailand, An Architectonic Introduction, White Lotus, 2000. ISBN 974-7534-40-1 External links Wat Thai, Dhamma Thai Thai Arts, Architecture Thai Temples Thai Stories Thai Architecture Buddhist Art, Architecture Pt. 1.